Welcome back to Game Friends. We're playing Skyward Sword. Excuse me. I feel like it's taking me longer than it should to do shit in this game. <coughs> but, but you know what? Well, you know what can you do? You know. What so can you're you do? saying the incentive to play if you can just buy this shit, right? Yeah. Like, okay, for a casual player, like somebody like myself, like the mass majority of people who would play Overwatch, if you can just buy these things that you otherwise are trying to earn by playing the game and there is no other alternative or no other um, you know no other reason to actually have the motivation to try to level up because you could just have the ability to buy these things then don't you think that's predatory do you feel that's some sort of predatory nature Making the infrastructure based around that. Would you say loot boxes are gambling? Uh, yeah, I guess a little bit. Oh, right? okay, cool. I don't. Need... All right, cool. All right. Then yeah, that's... but I don't play the game because I want loot boxes. You know what pisses me off, and and and, and I'll usually give Overwatch a pass. Um, usually, because I don't think they're as bad as like all the EA games and shit. <coughs> but I have felt pressured before to get. Uh, maybe I gotta leave. I have felt pressured before to try and buy loot boxes during certain events. To get specific skins uh, that you can only get during that event, and although I think it's it's a cool aspect um, because it does give it like some originality, at the same time I feel pressured into like oh I'm right like especially when I was in the oil field, we'll go with that. I barely had any time. <coughs> oh my god! Oh, I barely had any time to play. Right? And that was during Halloween. Let's just go down here. Fuck it. So, uh, and I ended up playing a little bit, and I did manage to get the some of the skins that I wanted to get by playing and getting loot boxes. Right? But, you know, that being said, and that's because for a while they were doing dupes to get coins, which I think that's stupid. Because imagine if you spent money on loot boxes and you, only got, and you got a bunch of duplicates. <laughs> Right, get a lot of dupes on top of that, but they got rid of it. As far as as far as I know, they got rid of it. No, it's still there. They're still there. Yeah, I thought they got rid of duplicates. Nope. Fucking lies. Okay. So that being said, like that's my beef with it, right? Because like I feel like it's putting pressure on me specifically to like, well, if you can always buy it. You yeah, know. but buying it doesn't guarantee you the shit, though. Does no, it? it doesn't. It doesn't. But as long as I have money, I have a chance. Yeah, but it just means you have cooler skins than like the average person. No, but I mean that's the thing, though. Like that is the main motivation to like leveling up and getting stuff is I could get those things. I mean, if you're a Momo, maybe. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? I feel like the competitive thing is that's what makes me like overwatch and why i play yeah but i mean that, but that's not a casual consensus and at the same time these mechanics are being applied to a bunch of other types of games and you're not going to have that same kind of inclination that you would for like nba 2k19 versus overwatch you'll you'll be competitive with overwatch as you might play i mean i get, i play competitive ufc too do they have loot boxes Shit. No. Microtransactions. I mean, they have it in other stuff, but it's completely different. Like, it's like it's here's stuff the thing. that I don't even mess with, to be honest with you. The Belgian government, Belgium, has outlawed loot boxes in video games. They consider it gambling, specifically structured to take advantage of children, minors. You know what I'm saying? Uh, because I don't know how many times I had kids fucking calling at, at um, you know, an Xbox. Or parents like, oh, my, somebody spent a thousand dollars. Well, you're fucked, sir. You know, 
<laughs> I mean, straight up, you know? So I, I, that's like my issue. That's like my beef. You know, it happens a lot. Like, it happens a lot where, you know, these kids will get their parents' cards. You know, whether... It, and the thing is, you know, we're not supposed to... Like, we're not supposed to refund microtransactions based on what the publisher says. So EA says, like, no, you can't return it because we can't get it back, which you can get it back. So here's the thing. They outlawed loot boxes. And just like that, a lot of companies, Activision Blizzard included, just flick the switch. No more loot boxes for purchase. You have to just play the game to get loot boxes now. I don't know. I don't knock the hustle. <coughs> you know. So I can see where it's coming from. You know, I just, I don't like that pressure. I don't like not being able to have, you know, just thinking like, oh, you know, it, they, they want me to. So, and like I said, Overwatch isn't that bad. That's why I usually give Overwatch a pass. But it's when, you know, the, 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 the events, like the, God damn it, dude, fucking webs. It's like when the events, you know, the, you know, the timed events take place. That's when I feel like a lot of pressure. Or that's when I used to feel a lot of pressure. And I can see a lot of other people being like, fuck it, I'm just gonna buy them. I only got two days left. That's not even enough for me to level up once, you know? So, like, that's my, that's my deal. Do I not have a key? Six minutes, bro, on fucking loot don't, boxes. Don't you hustle me, Joey! We need to talk about this. This is the thing that everybody needs to talk about. <coughs> I'm gonna go back to Pizza Hut, bro. Um. You got reds. Look. We need to bring Louie in to talk about it. What about... Okay, so... We got... Loot boxes... Oh, well, they turned it off. They considered it gambling. Okay. Like, Fortnite is the opposite. Yeah, you spend money on items a la carte. You know exactly what you're getting. Um... Okay, so there's another crystal in here somewhere. Speaking about Fortnite, thank God it's starting to die because Tim the Tapman has returned to Overwatch. Finally. Really? He was playing a bunch of Fortnite? Yeah, like he was playing that shit nonstop for like months. Dude, I, I took a I had to take a break. Thank I had to take God, a break from dude. Fortnite because I would get pressure. I'll go back after season six starts, which should be in a couple of yeah. Why do you like it too, fucker? Don't lie. I only like it because we play together, but I got <laughs> sick of it. Aww, Joey. <laughs> I can't <laughs> play your game anymore. Um, I think the biggest thing is that it has microtransactions, but it's free. And you know what you're paying for. So, in my book, Fortnite's doing it right. Um, But then, like, like fucking what, NBA, dude? All, like, all the EA games. Oh, oh, and... EA is refusing to remove loot boxes. They're outright refusing to do it. So they're, 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 it's being taken a case as a criminal criminal court case. And they're going to lose. I know they're going to lose. And if they lose, then that's going to be the downfall of that entire microtransaction structure. For... Like all games? For all games, I'm sure. It's going to be like the Howard versus Brown shit? I don't know what that is, but yeah, sure, we'll go with that. Yeah. Okay. What am I supposed to do, Joey? What in the tiddly fuck? Why don't you kill that spider over there? Fuck it. Fuck that spider and his family. And his family, Joey. What if he just clocked in? He's like, God damn it. Fucking hitting me with... with what if when you die... Alright. And you come back and you're that spider? <coughs> it's what you get. One is one is above and one is below. Right. No, I don't want you. Okay. So do you think, Derek, that they've made like, uh, like do you think that they like say like the super elite clone chip malfunction have uh, like the fucking fountain of youth? Uh, they could be immortals. Do you think like they're there? I don't know. It's hard to tell, right? I don't know. Would you be down for that though? Ah. Uh, I don't know. Cause scary. Cause dying is scary. Sometimes I kind of want to die. Yeah, you think that, but well, I mean, dying is scary. Actually but what else? To. You know what else is scary? Knowing that you're gonna live forever. That's also scary. Yeah, but at least like you know what's up. You know. No, dude, I'm gonna go to heaven. 
We're gonna. I'm gonna go to heaven. I'm yeah, gonna, but you don't know that for sure. No, I do know that for sure because I repent. And I have a relationship with God. Did you know that there's over 5,000 gods being worshipped today? Praise God. Yeah, but they're all the same one. It's all the same one. Not really. Yeah, really. I checked. No, they're all... They're Praise all, uh, God. They're all the right one. No. But they're not all the same. That's what I'm saying. They're all the same, Joey. They're all the same, dude. No, Muhammad's not the same. No, no, it's the same. Joey, you gotta understand, man. You gotta understand. Muhammad doesn't like Jesus, and no, Jesus doesn't like Muhammad. No, Jesus loves everybody. That's his thing. That's the, that's Jesus' thing. No, no, it's not, bro. No, that's Joey, Joey, look, you. look, listen, watch, watch. God loves you, and He wants you. Amen. Praise God. Title of this Hallelujah. Day. Praise God. Amen. Amen. This underhanded religious conversation <laughs> has begun. <laughs> So you believe that, Derek? That makes you hold, me wonder. You cold-heartedly believe that you're going to heaven? I mean, as long as I don't fuck up. Yeah. But what's fucking up? I don't know. Like raping, just being a human and thinking bad thoughts? Nah, that's because that's being human. That's being human. Free will is in the kit, as God says, you know? So yeah, free I mean, will's been on the chopping block lately. Uh, yeah, but because of people? Or because, like, because it got to be people, people saying that are it's not uh, actually the case. People people don't get to decide like now, do they? Science wise. Yeah, I don't get to decide. I decide. Can I not roll? I can roll. What do you feel about the Bible? Uh. Do you think it's a bunch of malokey? Um. I mean, you have a book that's been written from a third person perspective. Over several hundred years, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of shit that's lost in translations. So. Here's my biggest pet peeve about the Bible. Uh -huh. Is that the King Constantine handpicked what he wanted in it. Yeah, see, that's that's my issue. That's my biggest pet peeve. Yeah, it. see, that, that's, that's why I like... So that kind of, like, like, for me, shuts down everything about <coughs> the whole fucking everything about it. I think what you got to take away from it, Joey, is that there are fundamentals from it that you should just inherently know are right and that gives you the tools to kind of decide for yourself man i mean if if i was to say i'm like the perfect christian based on the bible then no i am not yeah but what do you say to like but, all the, like the other people that are like say like that they're muslim and they feel the same way they feel that you feel about their shit, you know? Like, are they wrong? What do you or mean? Or are you wrong? What do you mean, like, by Allah? Yeah, like, what if they're like, it's not Allah. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, dude! I really <laughs> don't! I'm getting so frustrated, you know? dude! I'm getting so frustrated with this shit! Didn't you beat this game already? In 2011. Yeah, that was a long time ago. Fuck. Seven fucking years ago. I'm getting mad! <laughs> Oh my god. Look. Fucking Jesus helps those who help themselves. I'm gonna figure Except this the shit Jews. out. Jews, he likes the Jews. Except the Jews. No, he likes the Jews too. I don't know. Dude, they I do understand. not know what they do. What I understand saying. what you're saying. Like, the, the basic principles yeah, are man. something to follow. Yeah. Like, if you take the whole God and shit out of Jesus and just look at Jesus as a person. He's very, uh... <laughs> well, I mean, he performed miracles, no? Yeah. Oh, uh, but we're, we're talking about fucking clone ships, and that's it, uh, but you're well, like... clone ships is a lot more believable. Why? People, people are Why way... Why is clone ships believable? Because people are fucking crazy, a dude. A clone chip? Yeah, dude, there's... Like, more... I believe a clone, but a clone chip? You know that they say... That there is a chip inside of Neo... What's his name? Neapolitan. The ice cream? Yeah. The I don't one. know what to do! They found a chip in old boy from France. The short dude. Uh, Napoleon. No. Everybody's full of crap. I don't believe anything anymore because it's so much outrageous shit and a lot of it's been disproven. It's like, nah, I'm not even gonna... But they have pictures. <coughs> I can fucking chop up a picture... See, yeah, I'm with you there. I'm with you that you really can't believe anything. I don't know, bro. 
Joey, where I don't know I if, we're, if we're young and we just... Where'd I go, Joey? Trying to figure shit out. You called me, Master? Yeah. Dude, this bitch doesn't know shit about shit. She talks a lot of shit. Where's Waterburger, bitch? That Zelda currently resides at Skyview Temple, located in the northeast. I'm fucking here. Oh my god. This, this We're at 15 minutes. Ah! <laughs> Hi, look, everybody. Um. Maybe we should have went to Bloodborne. Religious overtones or not. Uh, next time on a game for Freddy, we're gonna figure it out. Well, uh, I will have already figured out what the fuck to do. Actually, you know what? I think I just did. Next time. Next time.